This is the delightful comedian, star of television, Hollywood, and the Broadway stage, Peggy Cass. Thank you, and this is my partner, Dwayne Smith of Franklin Square, New York. This is the sensational young actor, soon to star in the forthcoming motion picture, Fedra, Anthony Perkins. Hello, and this is my partner, Mayoral Lee from Cheshire, Connecticut. And we're all here to play Password. <laughs> Yes, it's Password. Brought to you this evening by Super Shell Gasoline. With nine ingredients for top performance, for power, good mileage, and a smooth running engine. And now, here's your host on Password, Alan Ludden. Well, thank you. Good Sunday afternoon to you. It's good to have you with us playing Password. Nice to see you again, Peg. Hi, Alan. How are you? Fine. Tony Perkins, it's a pleasure to have you with us. Thank you. Peg, last year you were working with chimpanzees. This year you're working with photographers. What's this? Well, um, I'm not an authoress, but I'm posing for the pictures in a new book called First Lady. First Lady? Yes. Who's writing it? Uh, Patrick Dennis, who wrote Auntie Mame. And Little Me. Yes. Good. Well, it's a little different from the chimps, huh? Oh, well, it's the same thing in a way. It's hard. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk to your partner, Dwayne Smith, here. Dwayne, how do you like to keep busy, sir? Well, I'm a sales administrator for an electronics company, and in my spare time, I like to watch my son play football. Good. I hope he likes to watch you play Password. <laughs> Let's see. Tony Perkins got a movie coming out in two weeks, Fedra. Yep. Who's that lovely lady in it with you? Melina Mercury. How about her? And what about your new play? Uh, my new play is Harold. I'm going into rehearsal uh, next Tuesday, and we open at the Long Acre Theater in New York on November 29th. And the play is Harold. Yeah. We'll look forward to it. Good to have you here, sir. Thanks. Let's talk to Meryl Lee, your partner, Tony. Do you have a family, Meryl? I certainly do, Alan. Uh, I've been married for 11 years. I have five children, and we're trying to make room for one more. <laughs> good. Well, that's good news. Let's play Password. Here's how we do it. The object of our game, you know, is to make your partner say the password using one-word clues. Both teams work on the same word, and the one that gets it first, the one that scores. We'll start out this Sunday evening, our family game, if I can get it, the word out of the chute here. Here we go. I'll give the first word to uh, Peggy Cass, the same word to Tony Perkins, and while they look at it to see what they're going to do with it, we'd like you folks at home to see it. The password is shed. Okay, Peggy. First clue is yours worth 10 points. See if you can get Dwayne Smith to say that word. One word clue. Hair. <laughs> beard. Hair, beard. That was an interesting connotation. All right. Nine points, Tony. Tool. Kit. Tool, kit. Eight points, Peg. Um, fall. Broom. Fall, broom. All right, Tony, seven points. Cat. Five seconds, Mara. Smelly. <laughs> well, this is a revealing game sometimes, isn't it? Not always. All right, six points, Peg. Suit. Watch the Boop. gesture. Although that... Lint. Just... Suit, lint. Gestures don't always help, do they? No, five points, Tony. Fall. Dandruff. <laughs> no, not dandruff. Uh, four points, Peg. Hair. Brush. Brush. Three points, Tony. Hair. Tonic. Tonic. <laughs> Two points, Peg. Cow. Lick. <laughs> Cow lick. Oh, I see the hair cut. No, one point, Tony. Tool. Five seconds, Mara. Fur. No, could I just try one clue? What about wood? Nothing. <laughs> the word is shed. Shed. Interesting word. Nothing happened. Let's start all over again. Oh, no. Brilliant, right? <laughs> well, it was a difficult word, we'll say. Up the silent shoot it comes. Here it is. Okay, this time I'll give the word to Mara Lee, to Dwayne Smith. Starting all over, as they look at it, we'd like you to see it. The password is repair. Okay, Meryl, ten points yours. Mend. 
So. Men to so, nine points, Dwayne. Fix. Darn. Darn? No, eight points, Meryl. Together. Patch. Patch, seven points, Dwayne. Mechanical. Hmm, not mechanical. Um, patch. Ooh. Patch. No, it's not patch. Six points, Meryl. Construction. Repair. That's it. There we go. It's not ever a lousy clue if he gets it, Meryl, no, believe me. Not. So that gives you six points toward a 25-point game. You know, the winner of the game gets $250 and a chance to pick up more money in the lightning round, which is fun, too. All right, let's see what happens this time as I give the, the password to Peggy and to Tony and to you. Password is bold. All right, Peg. Ten points. First clue. Yours. Um, brash. Forward. Brash forward. Nine points, Tony. Brave. Bold. Bold is the word. Nice. It is very well, huh? Okay, that gives him 15. Incidentally, when you hear this sound... It means that your clue has not been accepted by our authority, who is Dr. Reason A. Goodwin, an editor of the forthcoming World Book Encyclopedia Dictionary. No, you don't want to hear that sound. One word clues will keep him from playing. Well, I won't say the score. I'll just give the word to Dwayne and to Merrill and to you. The password is jungle. All right, Dwayne, you have 10 points. First clue, yours. Tarzan. Ape. <laughs> That's what I would have said. Tarzan ape. That's what you would have said? Yep. Well, that would have been wrong. Nine points. <laughs> Undergrowth. Jungle. Oh. Jungle! <laughs> it's no <laughs> I have no commiseration. <laughs> I like friendly players, but as she said, don't commiserate. You're all right. We, I will tell you this, we've had this sort of score before, nothing to 24, and the team with nothing has come up from behind, as it were. Don't say that. Stump hearts, Wayne, stump hearts. That's encouragement. All right, Peggy and Tony have a new word, and as they look at it, we'd like you to see it. The password is leap. It's yours, Peg, 10 points. Lovers. Leap. I would have thought all night after lovers and said a thousand things, but never leap. By the way. <laughs> My God, lovers leap. Would you have thought of that? Well, she said it as if she were jumping. <laughs> she says everything as if she's jumping. All right, let's give it to Meryl this time and to Dwayne. And as they look at it, we'd like you to see it, please. The password is lawyer. Start with you, Meryl. Ten points. Legal. Just. Legal, just. Nine points would give you 19, Dwayne. Attorney. Lawyer. Lawyer gave you 19. <laughs> oh, no. That could have done it for you, Meryl. Now you see what we've got, 19 to 24. You never oh, know. No. This time never the word. <laughs> what? <laughs> What'd you say, Tony? No, nothing. <laughs> All right, let's go. I'll give the word to Tony and to Peggy and to you. Password is marionette. All right, Tony, it's yours. You only need one point. We'll give you ten. Puppet. Marionette. You did it. <laughs> and you would have said that. You know, now... Oh, what are you going to say? I was just going to say, now I can tell my husband I charge my new dress. <laughs> <laughs> you sure can, because you've got $250 and a kiss from Tony Perkins. And a chance That's to pick better, up. though. <laughs> it is? Don't tell your husband that. Yeah. All right. You have $250 and a chance to pick up $250 more in the lightning round. There are five passwords there. Tony's going to give you one word clues. Each word you get is worth $50 to you, Meryl. The only, and, Tony, you know if your clues aren't getting through, you move along to the next mm -hmm. word. The trick, as you know, is to do it in one minute. Here's the first word. Go. Money. Uh, dollar. Dollar. Bill. Money. Quarter. Next word. Next word. 
Yacht. Uh, boat. Port. Dock. Inlet. Harbor. That's it, Pippi. Uh, newspaper. Print. Man. Printer. Oh. Journalist. Editorial. Newspaper. You have 20 seconds, 25 seconds. 20 seconds, 20. Why don't you go to the next one? Next word. Asphalt. Jungle. <laughs> um, bathroom. Tile. That's it. Shine. Moon. <laughs> Laces. Uh, shoe. That's it. Meryl, that first word, that money he wanted you to go for, <laughs> in view of the fact that you charged that dress, I can see why it escaped you. It was cash. He was oh, yes. And that newspaper man he wanted was not the printer, but the reporter. Oh. But let's see what you have. Meryl Lee, you have 250 for the game, 150 for the lightning round, so Meryl Lee has $400. That's not all, Meryl. You could win some more money, or Dwayne, you could still win some money because we're going to play a second game now. But for that second game, we'll ask you, if you will, to change partners. We'll return in just a minute, but right now, here's something I'm sure that will interest you. Well, how do you feel, ladies? You all set? You ready? Manny, you all set? Ready to go. Okay, let's go with the second game. I'll start by giving the password to Peggy Cass. Tony Perkins, and as they study it, we'd like you to study it. The password is shriek. You got it, Tony? Yeah. All right, 10 points, first clue. Scream. Pierce. Pierce. No, nine points, Peggy. Mouse. Eek. You see, everybody does. <laughs> Better not say anything. Eight points, Tony. Yell! Shriek? Shriek! Yeah. <laughs> see, Peggy, you shriek and she eats. <laughs> okay. All right, the men have eight. Password this time to Meryl Lee. Dwayne Smith. And you. The password is prescription. Start with you, Meryl. Ten points. Druggists. Apothecaries. Druggists? Apothecaries. No. Nine points, Dwayne. Medicine? Pharmacy. Pharmacy. Eight points, Meryl. Writing. Prescription. Prescription is the word you guys are saying. So we've got a tied score there, which I like. And here comes a new word, and I'll give it this time to Tony Perkins. Peggy Cass, and you at home. The password is neutral. Okay, Tony, yours, 10 points. Peaceful. I didn't hear you, sorry, sir. Peaceful. Peaceful. Warlike. Peaceful warlike. Nine points, Peg. Uncommitted. I say. Quiet. Uncommitted quiet. Good clue, though, Peg. Eight points, Tone. E. <laughs> Switzerland. Neutral. Neutral! <laughs> Would you have gotten it with Switzerland? I think so. Yeah, I and you were going to say that same thing, Peg? I would have said it next. But uncommitted nations, I thought neutral. Yeah, yeah I thought uncommitted was, was good. That was a wonderful clue. Actually. All right, eight to 16. All right, Meryl, you try it. Dwayne? And you at home, please. The password is temperature. You'd have 18, Meryl. First clue. Fever. Blister. <laughs> no, nine points, uh, Dwayne. <laughs> Thermometer. Five seconds, Tony. Fahrenheit. The monitor Fahrenheit. Eight points, Meryl. 
high temperature. Temperature. Allegheny. You all are playing in ties here. Now it's 16 to 16, so this word could do it, you know. <laughs> It'll make somebody 24. Well, you have to start with 10. Nine, uh, they have it, as you know. Will you look at it, please? The password is shimmy. Okay, you'd have the game on the first one, Tony. Shake. Rattle. <laughs> you see this generation, no. Uh, nine points, you'd still have the game, Peg. Um... Gilda. Twist. <laughs> we'll talk about that. Eight points, Tony. Frenzied. Shimmy. 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 <laughs> yeah. Dwayne, may I question? Dwayne, may I question? Did you get it from Gilda or were you thinking of Gilda Gray? Well, Gilda Gray, I was thinking of. You're too young to remember Gilda Gray. Well, that, no, but Rita Hayworth was in the movie on the Gilda late show. Not Gilda. Well, I didn't Gilda. listen that hard. It worked. It worked. <laughs> anyway, he got it. Yeah, there. It worked for him. <laughs> All right, so we've got it's 60. 24, I told you. Well, did she shimmy and Gilda? Yes, yeah, shimmy. Like but Gilda Gray player. was the shimmy for those of us who can remember. All right. Like you, not me. Like me, not you. All right, here we go. Meryl and Dwayne have the word, and as they look at it, we'd like you to see it. The password is tender. Start with you, Meryl. You'd have the game. Gentle. Tender. <laughs> I don't think anybody in the world's more surprised than Meryl. Well, that? I, I, that's true. You really just have funny. another two hundred and fifty dollars. Buy another dress. <laughs> I'll okay. Buy two other dresses. All right. Here you go with the lightning round. Are you all set? Mm -hmm. The trick, oh. as you know, is to do it in one minute. Here's the first word. Go. Um, Gleason. Jack. Uh, oh. Um. Actor. Happy? Funny. Comic. All right, I'll take okay. it. Uh, swing. Hit. Uh, a tee. Golf. That's a hundred. Uh, pub. Beer. Yeah. Bar. Mm. Say something. Uh, you know, cloop. Oh. Say something. Uh, oh, I, I did. Uh, Next drink. Week. 20 seconds okay, left. Okay, spittoon. 15 seconds okay, left. Okay, go Next on. Words. This was right, what you just said. Uh, 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 delirious. <laughs> Ecstatic. Uh, snappy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Say something. Uh, Happy. That's right. it. Uh, Did she say saloon? She said saloon. All right. Let me get a did you say saloon, Marilyn? I didn't, know. Oh, I thought no, you did. Honestly, I'm so, I, I said thought something you, else. I thought you I... started to say saloon. Oh, you're a nice, honest no, lady. All right. No, so, saloon was the word there. We're not, we, she didn't say it. So, we, all right. And the last was child, but we you never got, got happy. Would you have gotten that with I five and a half? <laughs> <laughs> So what do you have there, Meryl? 400, 250, 150. Marilyn now has $800. You know, Dwayne, on our Sunday games, the more games you win, the more money you win, so you can still win some money. Mary, you can still win more money. We're going to play a third game now, but for it, we'll ask you, as you will, to return to your original partners. I got a <laughs> yes. We'll play more Password in a minute, but Dwayne. All right, are you all set? We know how to play the game. Let's just get started with our third game as I give the Password to Peggy and to Tony. And as they look at it, of course, we want you families at home to see it. The password is vest. Start with you, Peg. Ten points. Wesco. Vest. You did it. Well, <laughs> pretty good, though, right? <laughs> you were going to say what? Tattersall. Same thing. That would have been good. Would you have gotten it from Tattersall? No, I wouldn't have. You wouldn't have? Well, then, there you go. Meryl and Dwayne have the word this time. As they look at it, we'd like you to see it at home. The password is canal. Yours, Meryl. Venice. Lagoon. Lagoon. Suez. Canal. Canal. Don't 
feel bad. No, no. Suez or no. Panama would have been more direct, I guess. No, but Venice no. was picturesque. That was, I should have had it. 19 to nothing it stands. All right, here I go. The password this time. I Don't berate yourself, Tony. You're I a good said player. Gondola. You no. would, I thought you said gondolier. All right, here we go. Peggy and Tony have this word. As they look at it, we'd like you to see it. Well, the password is barrel. Start with you, Tony. Ten points. Before Monday. <laughs> Tell me when I have five seconds left. Five seconds. Oh. <laughs> Last. Apple. Pie. Apple pie. Nine points would give you the game, Peg. Keg. Cider. Keg cider. No, eight points, Tony. You're still in the running. Crate. Case. Crate, case. Seven points would give you the game. Beer. Barrel. Barrel. Give him the game. That was a tough one to go in the first one. Okay. Well, Dwayne, you got some money. Mm-hmm. And you played that barrel was an interesting was an interesting. I, you were trying to avoid getting it on. The, you wanted to get it in the ten pointer, didn't you, Tony? No, no, I did that. I couldn't think of anything else. You just wanted to get it. Well, <laughs> it played very well. In any case, Dwayne, you now have two hundred and fifty dollars and the chance to pick up two hundred and fifty more in our lightning round. You know how we play it. Five passwords, Peg. I caution you to move along if you're not getting through. Yes, sir. You all ready? Yes, sir. Let's go. One minute. Here's the first word. Go. Um. Doctor. Nurse. Good. Fifty. Uh, sad. <laughs> Happy. Um, bag. Satchel. Mm, um, sad. Sack. Good. Um, uh, weep. Cry. One hundred and fifty. Uh, flames. Fire. Fire. Two hundred. Uh, talk. Speak. Lots. Gab. Gab is good. How about those clues? Weren't they good? Those were good Terrific. clues. Were you thinking the same clues, Tony? Yeah, most of them. Really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but we do think alike, it's true. Except for, for, for lots. That, that I, I, you wouldn't have done lots? No. What would you have done? Well, it's academic, really, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> All right. I probably would have just sat there. And... <laughs> Tell me when it's five seconds. <laughs> In any case, Dwayne Smith, you have 250 for the game, 250 for the lightning round, and $500. Phew. We have uh, Dwayne Smith with $500 and Meryl Lee over here with $800. And I'm sure your husband is not going to resent that dress anymore. Not at is all. <laughs> no. Next week, we'll have two new contestants who'll be playing Password with our guest stars, who will be the popular musical director and television star Mitch Miller, playing along with a great Password favorite, television and stage comedian Carol Burnett. Your very good favorite, a girl you've asked to come back to play Password many times. Carol Burnett will be here along with a good friend of yours, Mitch Miller, and we'll be counting on you and your whole family. Peggy, I want to tell you that you played beautifully tonight. I made a comeback, at least. Yes, you did. You know, I think one of the reasons we see you so often on these panel games is that you really get in there to win, don't you? Well, I don't like to lose. No. How about you, Tony? Don't you play to win? Well, I have that competitive spirit, yes. Well, you played very well competitively tonight. Will you come back and play Password with us? Yes. Good luck with your show, Harold and Phaedra, the movie. And we'll be counting on you because you're one of the best Password players we've had around. I'll be back. Okay. We'll see you all next week at the same time or tomorrow on Daytime Password over most of these same CBS television stations. Until then, this is Alan Ludden saying the Password this Sunday is Couple. One of the most delightful show business couples, Sheila and Gordon McRae, play Password all next week. Hope you'll join us. So long. Have a good evening. <laughs> you were wonderful. We're still on. Password has been brought to you this evening by... <laughs> the new Polaroid automatic camera for finished pictures in 10 seconds. This has been a Mark Goodson, Bill Todman production.
this is Jack Clark. The contestants on this pre-recorded program were selected and interviewed in advance.